every one of you watching this screen. Look out. Anything can happen in the next half hour. What did I tell you about cartoons? They've got a lot of brains, and they've got a lot of cushions. Tell me how comic books make you feel, Dave. Surely you can't be serious. I am serious. And don't call me Shirley. Hi, this is Franz Cantor, illustrator, cartoonist, and toon talker, and I'm here with uh, Jim Bridges, and I'm left-handed and he's right-handed. But what does that mean? We're just sort of well, well I'm balanced. on your right, so we're knocking to each other. Yes, yes. This is uh, what this we're looking is, at today. That, that's him over there. So if you want, <laughs> yeah. to, that's him. This is 995. Frank Frazetta, the living legend. This is called. You could be able to probably find this on Amazon. It's got the price on it. Who's the publisher? Um, that's a good point. This would be Sun Litho Print. This is like a uh, Frazetta print put out by Frazetta put himself. Out himself. Yes, yes. Let's have a look at that. There you go. And what year? Oh, yeah. You can still buy T-shirts. Of course, his daughters now run the business. Yeah. So, when, um, when did he die? He died about four years ago. Oh, okay. It looks like a Vaughan Bode, a good Vaughan Bode, doesn't it? Yeah. Well, all Vaughan Bode are good Vaughan Oh, are they? Yes, oh. they are. <laughs> Um, okay, so just a little bit of a warning. Yes, there is a little bit of uh, uh, naked bits in here. We'll try and naked bits. keep them to a minimum. Yes. But just try to remember that this is an art book. Yeah, fantasy. He's an artist. Fantasy. So we'll, we'll, we'll attack it with a... With a we'll uh, look, a naked bat. We'll, we'll, we'll look at this with... Uh, oh, he signed it, look. The eyes what? of an artist, yeah. Yeah, and who's that? That's Vampirella. That's right. That's a beautiful... He did a few um, vampies. Did he? For uh, Warrant Publishing. Okay, and, um, let's move on. Yeah, and this is a particularly nice one. You can see her, her face. Very beautiful. Has she got a, a, a tattoo of a bat on her breast? Uh, yes. I'm oh, shocked. Has. Well, here he is. So here he is. He's working on something that uh, I've only ever seen in one of his calendars. So he's a right-handed too. It's like, a, like uh, you. the Gate of Hell, I think this painting's called. Oh, okay. Um, that's, not obvi that's obviously not a brush that he uses. Yes. No, <laughs> it's no. like a six-inch house brush. Yeah. Um, but have a look at his pen yeah, style. Isn't it a great drawing? Even in a loose no, pen style. Isn't it a great drawing? It's magnificent. Like it's a really stocky man, yeah. uh, demon or whatever. Yeah, but he had this sort of chunky, scribbly like yes. uh, pen style, yes. um, and he was able to get very beautiful it's shapes. Early Frazetta. You know, there's a yeah, there's an early Frazetta yeah. there. Um, One and a half with his puppy Rex. Mm. Yeah. Although Rex doesn't look that good, does he? No. Now look at some of these yeah. uh, characters, these little studies. Oh. They're pen drawings, beautiful cross-hatching. He was a, a, a very accomplished comic book artist. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he's... He did Al, Al Cap. Uh, sorry. He worked for Al. Yeah. He worked with Al Cap. He did, uh, what's it called, uh, Lil Abner for a while? Yeah. And, and this is a classic... This is, a, this you is have a to see this, it's yeah, actually, very difficult to see in such a small format. Let's do it this way. But it's a, it's a spec uh, layout done in his early 20s. And in particular, this scene here of the cliffs yeah. uh, portend his it's, um, interest in prehistoric, prehistoric yeah, but scenery. They're, 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 we'll try they're and get iconic. a better shot They're really this. iconic. It's like someone yeah. drew that like 300 years ago or something. Yeah, yeah. so there's him doing his best Clint Eastwood. Uh, no, that's his James Dean person. No, sure. that's, not. that's a bit that's that's James too Dean. for James Dean. Oh. That's more of a Will James Dean. Will you keep the sexual politics out of this place? Ah, oh, love this stuff. No, I'm not happy casting aspersions of James Dean. I just think that looks more... Look at the hair on her. Mus ...muscled than James Dean would have liked. That's thunder. Yes. Yeah, did you zoom up on her boobs? No, her hair. Oh, OK. Let's look at his early uh, pen work. Yeah. And brush work. For a comic. Beautiful. Look at the back thunder. of the, the, the guy here. Yeah. I'm pretty sure he's... Um, 
That's, those, those, are, is it a bit like Kirby? Those muscles don't exist? They don't exist, no. Yeah, okay. Right. So it would take a, a few more years to get into, um, you know, correct uh, proportions and uh, yeah. where the muscles lay. Oh, look at that. Mm. You can feel the crunch there, can't you? So he's landed in a prehistoric place. Yeah. And he's obviously had to turn into a, a like a Tarzan character. Mm. So you can start to see his signature poses here, yeah. this strength in this, those this, this, you know. those arch, you know, it's like the final, yeah, the coup de grace punch or the coup de grace, the action, the the ultimate point of where the the action is heading. Sorry. So very accomplished. Incredibly well done. Well, I suspect these are characters uh, modeled on his expressions. Like Shangri-La, the movie Shangri-La. Yeah. Mm. The, the, the one with um, Coleman in it. One so very powerful ones. comics. Big Snake. So this is why this book's put together um, predominantly to have a look at his comic book uh, stuff. This is a lovely um, little quick little sketch there of a Flash Gordon type of uh, yeah. character. Yes. So fluid, so beautiful. I really enjoy those. Would, would uh, this have been a cover? This would be uh, look like a cover. A cover. Yeah, you yeah. have the banner at the top. Yeah, it's separated. Same with all of these. You have the banner at the top. Sort of. You really got to get in close. Look. Look at the. Yeah, very tight. So it doesn't have. It's got this sort of tight muscles, but don't they don't yet have that movement that Frazetta is known for in his muscles, in his uh, poses. But all that work he's done for a he's comic. He's, he's, yeah, all that, all that for movement. Yeah, they say. Look at that. Yeah, so Frazetta is really known for both his signature, which is uh, that, and also his uh, a lot of movement in the um, action, in the actual poses themselves. You can see that beautiful uh, the girl floating in space. That's not the uh, beginning of Kirby Crackle, is it? Uh, that's more like Frazetta explosions. Oh, okay, yeah. That's beautiful. That the, is a the really, curve, the curve really back, well the curve back. Look at that hair. Yeah. yeah. I would say uh, there's a, a Jeffrey Jones uh, comic that uh, that reminds me of too. A lot of attention to black to the shadows. Yes. To create a, a heavy contrast between the figure and the background. So we're now in. Again, some... we've got Frazetta drawn here himself. Right? Yeah. Well, it's His cheaper, likeness. isn't it? It's cheaper. Yeah. Because he, he used models, I know that. Yeah. There's lots of photos That's, of him. That's, uh, I believe, a Sadie Hawkins, Little Abner's um, okay. poster, pin-up. He got Sadie married. Sadie Hawkins Day. He did that's, the right thing. That's him he, with he, um, Ellie. He did the right wife. thing. This is a, sort of a take on the Femlin Playboy um, yeah, that's, figure. Yeah, that's a spot yeah. Elo. So he was, a, he was a gun for hire, so he yeah. would have tried to, spot Elo. to get work. Look how beautiful this it's so loose and yet yeah, it's perfect right it's almost yeah. like one of his his classic loose chunky paintings come to life yeah really has a, a, everything in it so much drama and uh, and and purpose. Be beauty and the beast yeah he revisited this again um, I think it's called at the Earth's core which is a beautiful painting so when we look at the paintings we're going to uh, point that out but uh, I mean, just look at these. It's just magic. Look at the the, the swirl, look, the water, yeah. creating this uh, beautiful well, the contrast connection between, and the connection. Yeah, but and connection between the yeah. the crocodile yeah. and Tarzan. So you know, is or the alligator would be in in Africa, wouldn't it? The alligator and um, or do they have crocodiles? They have crocodiles. So the alligators the, in America. Oh, okay, got it. All right, so <laughs> the crocodile. And, what did Porky and, Pig say? He said, croc, 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 alligator. <laughs> yeah. Look at that beautiful uh, shading on that croc, Tarzan, yeah. the pose. But look at See, this he guy. he started to look, really, look at that really pose. analyze. Look at that pose. Yeah. Action. He's really looked at action. You know, he was a physical man. He, yeah. he I'm sure he boxed, but he, he was a very physical man. He used to play baseball a lot. So um, baseball is sort of like a sport version of, of ballet. Is it? In a way, it's very um, fluid. There's a lot of running and, and not much jumping. He did a, a portrait of um, Ringo Starr. Yes. 
Mad Magazine. So this is a beautiful, uh, I don't know why they put that, this is a magnificent color uh, painting. Yeah, well, there's, all, the there's no color in this book. Um, this again, uh, this is the interior of Mad Magazine. I'm not sure if he painted this in black and white. And there's, there's, there's his, his crazy lions, which are really, yeah. so like, he's, they're frightening. He loved lions and wolves. Yeah. Lions, tigers and wolves, oh my. So he's really, really into that stuff. So you've got, and dragons, you know, who's a really good at dragons as well. Mm. This is uh, his, uh, this is from the Mars series. A sketch of, um, uh, what's the name, Thor, Thoris? I can, I can see uh, Storenko checking yes. this out. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah. It's the last comic done for EC left incomplete because of failure of the line in the books. Mm. It's that her heroic pose. Yeah. So look at these beautiful uh, studies here. Yeah. Well, they're spot illustrations that are incomplete. Yeah. But they're, they're, as themselves, they're beautiful ink studies of light and dark. Ooh, look at Here we go with a Pellucidar series again. The, say that again. Pellucidar. Oh, everybody knows those. Yeah, so look at that. They're beautiful. And there's those cliffs again. Yeah. He really loved um, textures and cliffs. He loved drama. You know, the, the world of prehistory. Get a close up on that face. This uh, Robert E. Howard. Get a on, close up on, on the face of the, um, on, on of, of the tiger. Oh, okay. See, see the hair, little hairs on it? Little... Yeah. Saber tooth and the, the brush lines and it's creating the arm muscle back. The whole arm, look at mm. Yeah, I think this guy's pretty good. He did another one like this with these. Um, he's used these uh, pterodactyls or pteranodons quite well. And uh, just sorry, before we turn, he's used these as devices because what they do when they attack in his comics, not in reality. But in his, in his pictures, when they attack, they create this beautiful ballet, aerial ballet, which enclose the, the hero or the yeah, prey yeah, yeah. in this sort of window of death. Magnificent. He did that a few times. There's this drama that creates yeah. the ultimate, um, you know, the, the love of wildlife, the love of wildlife coming down right to the grass. So nothing escaped his attention, and he treated it with such... Uh, uh, beautiful love, you know, just enough information. Of course, he bleached it all out and have, you know, and Tarzan's held in place by the shadows that Tarzan and the ti uh, lion create in the grass itself. Have a look at some of these uh, cross hatching. This is sort of the basket weave like effect. Yeah. See the, the hatch lines create contour. And look at the They knife. follow the look curves the of the muscles. Yeah. And the, you know, and, and that's a beautiful he, he, like composition. Like he really worked here, you know, like... Well, he became a master of composition. Really, nobody could uh, beat him with, uh, you know, composition, particularly with his paintings. So, Isn't that beautiful? Look at it. God. Yeah. And look at the, the, um, the, the cockeyed snarl of the, of the, ty of yeah. the lion, yeah. you know. It's like one eye is... It's, is it's better than MGM, most. isn't it? Mm. But it's so perfect. This, I've never seen anybody be able to create this level of drama and movement with a pen or a brush. That's interesting, isn't it? This is obviously a pen, yeah. right? But even in the doodle lines that you could see here, it's just magic. It's just explodes I reckon, with action and light. I reckon he would have known about Heinrich Clay. Yes. I'm pretty sure he would have. Yes, well, he would have probably studied it in college. Yeah. This is Ellie, his wife, and his kids, his daughters. This is his uh, um, Lord of the Rings series. This is Gandalf. Um, these are dwarves. This is obviously from The Hobbit. Um, but he, another thing about uh, Fazetta, he had this beautiful um, way of treating wood, like bran dead branches and yeah. tree trunks and things like that. So whenever you see that sort of primeval, you know, mushroom encrusted, slime encrusted stuff, um, nobody could do it better than, than Frazetta. This is from The Hobbit again, yeah. meeting a wag mm. in the that wilderness. tongue's definitely hanging this out, This is a death, the death of uh, um, one of the Nazgul, right? This is, um, I'm just covering her bum. 
This is uh, yeah. The, look, look at this bit instead. Princess. Yes. Yeah. Um, I can't remember her name. This Here's year. another shot of her killing yeah. the uh, or, or being attacked by the uh, by the Nazgul. Off his mm. off his dragon. Off his These dragon. are orcs. Orcs Hello. marching down. Now these paintings influenced um, Ralph Bakshi to make uh, not just wizards. It created it created wizards, but also Ralph Bakshi's Lord of the Rings. It is that horse, that classic, yes. incredibly powerful. Yes, this is, uh, uh, is uh, the is barbarian. It, is it Conan? Conan? No, no, he's um, um, who's the guy that conquered Europe? Um, Attila. No, oh, the Hun. Attila, the Hun. Yes. That's not Attila. The Hun. Yes, or it could be, you know, the guy that uh, they built the Chinese Wall, the Wall of China, keep out. That's a Dill of the Hunt. Yeah, beautiful. That's definitely a yeah, Dill of the Hunt. Look at the delicate Chinese, almost Chinese like. Hang on. Um, Point to what you're. What are you turning the book? No, because I'm, I'm turning the. So you can look at this picture here, so. Oh, underneath, yeah. Look at the beautiful decorative uh, clouds, you know, the Chinese looking, the, the, the uh, tortured painted clouds in the sky. Did he do westerns? He did a few paintings of westerns, which were also very good. He had this love of uh, subjects. Because his horses are trans terrific. Transcended, transcended many of the uh, yeah. um, genres. So he was really into horses and animals and the dynamics of action. This is the... the, um, the uh, John Carter. Carter on Mars, yeah. These are some of the quick sketches he yeah. put together for the painting. Um, this is a probably interior sketch. They used to draw, uh, draw interior sketches for the books. She's going to hurt herself. So some of his uh, figure studies. Beautiful. Look, look at the yes. horse. Yes. Get close in that's, on that. That's Red Sonia, isn't it? I mean, look at that's that. That's Red Sonia, isn't it? No, that would be another elf queen or something. Okay. I can't probably it's from a great face, isn't it? On the horse. Yeah. But even the expression. Mr. Ed yeah. could never make an expression like that. <laughs> Wilbur. <laughs> oh, Wilbur. Here we go with more um, this, uh, archetypes. Yeah, but so, there's this. There's this mm, um, the pyramid construction. Yeah. The pyramid. Uh, the heroic. The heroic stuff. Yeah. So these were interior plates, obviously, for books. Yeah. Beautiful stuff. Just move it over to this. They're center. obviously in the water. Yeah, see how sinewy the movement is, you know? Yeah. There's a bit of a nude bits in there, so we're not going to... Bits. Kind of... Look at these. Look these at these are lions. my favourite of all the these. lions that he's done. Have a look at that. That's magnificent. It just... Oh, it's just... I wish lions were this pretty. Well, I'm... I'm impressed because of, um, I always thought the tigers looked even Nero's more ferocious. Having a bath, but look at the cliffs and the rocks here. You yeah. know, and there's some perves. Oh, there's always a perv. Ponytail, yeah. ponytail perves. And uh, look at the way he's treated this moss. Yeah, because it, yeah, it's organic. The tree, you know, it's, it's, it's really magical. So he he loved golf. He was a very physical man. You could see, you know. Oh, look, he was in Hard Day's Night. <laughs> No, that's help, actually. Yes. So, uh, there he is with Clint, and this is with oh. his painting for oh, the gauntlet. The gauntlet, that's right. Again. He did the poster. Last night, yes. beautiful film. That, well, I think the I, I think the poster is the best thing about the film, personally. I quite like the film. I got into the film after I saw the poster. I thought I, 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 I yeah, was that a poster for I, a movie? It could have been Fantastic. a contender. Yeah. Oh yeah, he was a big fan. Sylvester Sloan, of course, well, big he, art collector. Big, big art big, collector. Yeah. yeah. And uh, this Spengali. is the uh, Spengali is the uh, Bo Derek's. Um, this is um, her husband. Oh yeah, um, the actor. Yeah, Derek. Derek, Bo Derek. Yeah. No, his name's not. Uh, Bo Derek. <laughs> well, that's but her name, Bo Derek. Company. Spengali was John Derek. Their company, John Derek. Yeah. Oh look, he's getting sloppy. Well, this is how he he uh, signed his work in the black and white series. Yeah. In paint, he didn't make these little loops. And this is one of his most there. You well, can see there's yeah. no loops there. But that's the one that um, pyramid that slide board composition in the background. Mm. Yeah. Well, I, and, I don't but, know if he bought it. And there he is. He would have definitely been a, an admirer. 
And that's well, him. So he's a crazy guy. Look, there's a lot of bad things said about Frazetta, but, you know, that he was sexist and he was a bit of a brute and, you know, um, uh, anti-Semitic and, and really racist and all this sort of stuff. But, I mean, they were really at the end of his, uh, his career when he was more um, sort of a grumpy old guy, I guess. But um, It happens to all of us. Yeah, I suppose. Yeah. I just find his work really, really valuable. Some of that stuff looks like it was and done in the 30s. It, it looks Frizetta. like it was done in the 30s. Yeah, know? absolutely. It's got that really old style. Well, it kind of bridged the 1930s to the 1970s. Yeah, yeah. So it brought a bit of culture to the 1970s. Um, without him, many artists would never have uh, ventured into fantasy, certainly me and, uh, well, you know, I mean, definitely Jeffrey Jones. And, they wouldn't have bought the books in the first place, would they? Because yeah. he did the covers. Bernie Wrightson, um, a lot of great artists that, yeah. that we've enjoyed over the years, uh, kind of started with uh, Frazetta. I first saw him, his book, The um, Fantastic Art of Frazetta, in uh, I think it was 1973 or four. Mm. Anyway, um, enjoy the book. Uh, try to find it. It's well worth. I mean, this is it's falling to bits. Worn, it's falling to bits. Worn out. Yeah. And tired. It's um, tired. Listen, don't forget to subscribe. Please subscribe to our channel. You'll be getting great films and give us ideas of what films that you'd like to see. Uh, this is uh, uh, ring the uh, uh, subs hit the subscribe button and ring the little bell to get notified. Ding. This is France Cantor and Jim Bridges. Same. See you next time. See you next time. Thank you. Bye. Thanks for the sour persimmons, cousin.